in this video I am gonna show how to set up your SD card on your transcendent IP camera and how to record so I am gonna be using as an example the VTD dash T and MD for RFS so I'm gonna go ahead and log into it and the first time you log in you're gonna go to config and under system you're gonna click on storage and format your drive once you format your drive I'm not gonna do it for this example just to show you the previous recorded data but once you format you're gonna go to record and select what stream you want the SD card to record um, for this example I'm gonna be using the main stream but if you need to reserve the memory on your SD card you might want to do a lower stream uh, once this is done then uh, you're gonna go to alarm and motion detection and basically all you have to do is where it says trigger SD recording is you want to enable that I have it enabled already but default it doesn't it comes without being uh, uh, enabled so you want to select it and save then you want to go to area and you want to select either all your uh, view or select only some of it by uh, drawing the spot that you want to trigger the uh, motion recording onto the SD card and once you do that then you want to go to schedule and there's already a pre-configured 24-7 recording schedule done there if you want to be more specific and do a uh, custom then you would obviously do erase and erase the times that you want not for the SD card to record but uh, for this example I am just gonna leave it the way it is and select all so now it's set to record every time there's motion so now I'm gonna um, enable motion and this icon right here this little man right here which says motion detection should go red so I'm gonna wave my arm motion went through so now we're gonna check the search and we're gonna be looking for this time at 1247 so it's still recording as long as this is on so now to review your playback you're gonna go to search and uh, you're gonna click on video and local view is when it records onto the local DVR or sorry into the local computer so you don't want to do that you want to go to SD card recording and you see how the 17th is uh, highlighted red because there's data there it, uh, if uh, I were to leave it on over the weekend which I am I'm gonna make another video it's gonna show the other days so one you select your day and then you click search and all your motions pop up so I will select today and here it is and that's how you review your playback now from here if I double tap on this screen it's gonna go to my other monitor and it's gonna be a full full view full screen kind of deal uh, and here is to record the download let's say this was an incident and you want to download this footage you could just click here and download uh, like I said I will go through an extensive uh, video but this one is just on how to configure your SD card. Thank you.